I love Chinese food. It's definitely my favorite. If it's not pizza, it's Chinese. So right. um, probably Chinese is probably going to end up being my first. What's going on, my little piglets? It's your BFF Pork Shop here, and I'm coming at you with another food review. Got my sister with me for the first time. This will be the second time we've tried to do a food review. The first one didn't go so well because the audio got corrupted and I couldn't do it. So I was very upset. I redeemed her because she wanted to do this. She personally pointed this out to me, and she wanted to do the uh, Passport to Flavor Lay's chips. Instead of doing the Do Us a Flavor, they're doing the Passport to Flavor where you can redeem the stuff for miles so that you can go on vacations and stuff. So they have, I'm not even going to try to pronounce these because this is ridiculous. I'm just going to say we have the Chinese one. Brazil. Greek. And India. 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 Okay, so before we get started prediction, what order do you think it's going to be in from your favorite to least favorite? I love Chinese food. It's definitely my favorite. If it's not pizza, it's Chinese. So... Um, probably Chinese is probably going to end up being my first. From the pictures, maybe? Maybe the Chinese one, then the Brazilian one, and then the Greek one, and then the Indian one. See, mine, I think it's going to be, it's going to be the Chinese. I think it's going to be the Indian, because I like kettle cooked, and these are kettle cooked. Okay. Uh, Brazilian, and then simply due to the cucumbers, because cucumbers is touch and go with me. Greek will be last for me. So since this one's going to be our favorite one, I think we should go ahead and give this a shot. Oh, oh. Yeah. Ooh, I smelled it right when I opened it. Oh, smell that. It smells like... It smells really good. smells like one. There you go. And here we go. Ready? <laughs> oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. It reminds me of the flavoring of... Chicken ramen noodles. Ooh, it's got a little kick to it too. Mm -hmm. And then as it sits in your mouth, it kind of has extended flavors added onto it. See, chicken is my favorite meat to eat, so this is amazing right here. Yeah, it's Okay, so why don't we give the kettle cooked Indian. Oh, this is the best one, I'm not gonna lie. Yeah, that's not too bad. It smells like curry. Yeah, it's like curry. There you go. Oh, I gave you a big one. Oh my god, you did such a big one. I hate it. If you hate it, then I'm eating the rest already. And go. Mm. Mm. Hmm. Kind of has like a sour cream and onion taste to it a little bit. Mixed in with some other stuff. What do you think? Just don't chew on it. Chew on it. Chew on it. Not a huge piece. I'll die. I gave her a big piece. Um. <laughs> Okay, I know I just compared the first one to ramen. But that one. But this one tastes like ramen. They all taste like ramen, spoiler alert. <laughs> I don't know. I just I'm seriously getting this is more of like whenever you finish the ramen, the aftertaste of what it tastes like, and then this is the powder. Just so the powder. These two are like batman and ramen right here. Basically. Alright. Not bad though. Brazilian! This one Jocelyn said just tastes like straight up meat. That's what really? It tastes like meat. It looks like sour cream and onion chips. That's what it looks like. There we go. It tastes like meat. Oh. That's a different flavor. <laughs> oh, that's different. Steak. Steak sauce. Steak and sauce. That's what it supposed to taste like. Mm. So, definitely tastes like steak. It tastes like shit in ass. <laughs> in that order. <laughs> it doesn't smell too good either, so. I was hoping, because whenever I smelt it, it tasted kind of like lime. Mm -hmm. And I was hoping, because I'm in love with the lime um, chips by Lay's. They're really good, one of my favorites, and I was hoping when I smelt that, that the, there would be a lime Lay's chips taste to it, and it's not. Yeah, it's, it's terrible. Steak and sauce. So right. that's probably my least favorite. So okay. yeah, just, just put that to the side. <laughs> and last, we got the Greek, which by the looks of it, looks like it's like a cucumber type of. Looks like. Oh wait, I think it's the stop. 
This is the sauce that they put on the Euros. You ever had a Euro? This is what they put on the Euro. So last year they had the Euro flavor. This year they had this one. Man, Blaze, stop trying to make Euros happen. It's not going to happen. <laughs> yeah, that's the sauce that they put on top of the Euros. That's what it is. And they're weavies. And last, but hopefully not least. Let's go. Mm-hmm. 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 That tastes just like the Euros from last year with that cucumber-based sauce. If that tastes up. I think those taste a lot better than last year's. This one? No. These. Oh. These better than last year's. Oh, yeah, Euros. definitely. Oh, yeah, definitely. Those taste a lot better. Those are good, though. These are good. I would snack on these. Those were better than last year's, and I say that because I did not like last year's at, at all, whatsoever. But... See, I think those were Jocelyn's favorite last year. This is... I don't remember one of my favorites last year. Biscuits and gravy all day! I think... I don't know if it was a part of this challenge or whatever last year, but they had these... Um, well, those are my favorite. I don't think they make them anymore, but it was the wasabi and ginger. Yeah, I think they said that like two or three years ago. Oh my god, those were my favorite, and they don't have them anymore, no, so... because they didn't win. You have to vote. No, they won't. They won't. Well, I voted, so... <laughs> I did too. Biscuits and gravy was the one that won, so I picked the winner. So, ladies and gents, this is just your lesson of the day that your votes don't count. Your votes don't count. So. <laughs> it's all rigged. I'm just kidding, but... Alright, so, favorite to least. Okay, I would say my number one's probably Ooh. the Chinese... Man, we both called that. And number two, probably the Indian, surprisingly. Cool. Three, the Greek, and very, 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 very last place, the Brazilian. See, mine are, okay, mine first and last are the same. These two are switched. I'm going to have to go chicken, then the Greek, the Indian, and then last, the Brazilian. You guys are good at soccer, terrible at making chip flavors. All, I say. all right, so guys, what do you think your favorites would be? Rank it from least to greatest or greatest to least, whatever. I don't grade. I don't grade on her or anything. But yeah, so guys, let us know which one you think is better. Should I bring her back? I, no. Democracy rules on this channel, so you guys ask for Chris to do food reviews. So if you want her to start doing food reviews, let me know down below. And as always, you can hit that subscribe button right there. Come to Piglet to stay in touch with my videos. Go like me on Facebook, follow me on my Twitter, Snapchat. All those links are down in the description. And always remember my little piglets calling Porkchop. Loves y'all the most. Y'all take it easy, guys. And I will see y'all next time, hopefully with her. If I don't kill her. Bye, guys!